He called the Grange his sweet project in writing to his wife, and, and it was truly consuming for him. I think in a way the design of the Grange was as important to him as the design of the federal financial system was. To move a building of this significance onto a new site, you really have to have a strong reason to do that. Well, every job is a different challenge. This job, there was more preparation time required. One big challenge was the height that we had to raise it to go over the church with the amount of the weight of the building weight. You are moving 300 ton over this foundation, even though the number's like telling you it's okay, but unless you see the house rolling over this foundation, your heart is beating at a high rate. It's the complexity of having to get it out of the site in which it won't fit, and it's the complexity of having to take it down complex turns and, and steep grades. One, two, three, push, push, push. It's moving. Our overall goal was to restore the Grange so it would best reflect the life of Alexander Hamilton. There are a lot of issues involved in restoration, particularly when you're moving a house. But what we will achieve is a sense as you approach the house that you're approaching a monumental structure, and that's exactly what Hamilton intended. It was so constrained, so hidden in its last spot that now I think it's really going to be in its full glory, and I think everyone's going to be just amazed and proud of what they see.